Hello there, I'm Aldra Hill. Welcome back to E4 Mongolia. We are attempting to try and get enough war score here to be able to finally break out of this war. Um, we do have... we don't have enough war score, this is the problem. But once we do, I think we'll be fine. There we go. Try and get rid of these damn sieges. Go there. You go there. Break some of these bad boys out, because it's getting a bit ridiculous now. Alright, I don't think I need this many cavalry men either. Here we are. Ming is in a civil war. Uh, that's, there's your right. Douche. I'm going to blow through my power to try and get through some of this. I think I, I, I kind of have to, honestly. Why is my war score just so low? Because oh, they just keep occupying a bunch of territory, don't they? Alright, let's just blow through their forts. There we go. Ah, oh, the loans. The loans, they hurt me so. Yes, I know. You're a rebel and you like rebelling. Shocker. What? Where did you come from? Oh my god, now there's more ripples! Why is there so much rebellion? Can you all just calm the hell down? I actually don't understand why this is happening. Why is there so much rebellion? Because you're attacked? Reassessments. Oh god, this is in Outer Mongolia, isn't it? Oh Jesus. But it's easier to deal with that than it is to deal with Japanese, so... Got the war goal, so that's something. No, oh, fuck off. Rightful ownership. Loses core in Argon and loses claim in Argon and cede Argon to Kazakh. What? Argon? I don't care. No, because I'm just gonna have to recore that. Go away. Leave me alone, you jerk. I just take things. I don't belong to you. Alright, let's also start to try and get rid of some of these extraneous sieges that are occurring. Yes, yes, yes. You're all insulting me. Ah, oh, there we go. That's gonna help. That's gonna help a lot. I just need these two provinces. That's literally all I need. Let's go, let's go. Woo is no man frontier. <laughs> I forgot because they're technically the, um... Yeah, they are. Because they're Wu, they're the Emperor of China, so they're gonna get the Nomad Frontier Malice. Ah, two stability, 20 mandate. Bye. All right, keep going, boys. Let's go. You just keep sieging this bad boy down. Ugh, I have to waste so many points to try and survive this crap. Oh, they're still doing stuff too. All right, it's okay as long as they don't get our capital too soon. Oh my god, the the tribes are already rebelling. Oh, where do all my troops go? They're too far away. Okay. Um, 11 days left. 7th of March. 30 days, September, April, June, and November. So, 30th, 31st. Then two days. So, if I can wait two days. Perfect. Get him. Oh my god, what? I did not calculate that right. Okay, took a little bit longer, it seems, than I expected. Fixed move, bro. Oh my god, and they're appearing here too. Please leave me alone. 
I suppose it's not a gigantic deal, but... No, stop it. We waste so much military power doing this. Thirtieth of April, sixteenth of May. Jesus. Sixteenth of May. Sixth of May. I time this right. And fifteenth, and there we go. Let's go. Kill these goddamn tribes. Okay. Try and break their tribal control over everything. Where the hell do you think you're going? Can I please peace out? Oh, I'm really close. If I can get one more war score, I can peace out. I'm fully out of manpower as well. Jesus Christ. Hey, look at that. There's your right, you jerk. Oh, the manpower. Yeah, I have to peace out literally the second I'm able to. Oh, please. Can I do it? Oh my god, I can peace out. Oh my god, thank you. I can leave this war. Give me a pile of cash. Oh. Thank god. Oh my god. What an ordeal that was. Jesus Christ. Mothball all our forts again. Ugh. I thought it was never gonna end. Oh my god. It's over. It's finally over. Ah, I can form Great Juan. It's good stuff. It's also going to take me several years to kind of get over this, but... Maybe we'll wait. Oh, boy. Oh, these rebels in Xinjiang as well. Everybody go there. Uh, Beijing, rather. What? More? Stop that. Stop that right now. Okay. So we're killing everybody, and I lost my general. Okay. Still got a good one. That's fine. Do No, not infantry. Cavalry. Always forget to do that. Okay, cool. You guys are going to head over here. Try and fight them a little bit. I have lost... I've lost some men in this war, to say the least. Okay, it's fine. Gotta kill these rebels. The first circumnavigation from Portugal. Congratulations, I'm so happy for you. The Age of Absolutism. Here we go. Enables absolutism mechanics. Let's take a look at this. Um... Have a land force them with 200 regiments? Sure. Universities? No. Trade companies? No. Absolutism? No. Emperor of China with a mandate of 50? Yes, I can certainly achieve that one. Five different promoted cultures. And win a religious war in the Religious League. Oh, that's not going to happen, unfortunately. All right, absolutism. You can become more absolute in this era. Giving greater control over states. Decrease so basically, I need to decrease autonomy constantly and strengthen government and also harsh treatment. But mainly decrease autonomy. Oh, okay. Fine. It's fine. Gotta keep an eye on our nation. Our absolutism is, of course, very low. But it can get stronger. Let's spend a little bit to increase horde unity and absolutism, which gives us discipline, administrative efficiency, and court, foreign core duration. Just gotta wipe these guys out, shall we? Not today, bitch. Yes, you- no, you can't have that. Go away. Alright, we're ripening rebels out bit by bit. And then we're gonna fight the Wu. Wu of a kind. 
I will take the admin power. Thank you. Global trade is going to start to... is actually spreading already, which is great. We just gotta wait for it. Might be better idea if we kill the rebels first before we try anything else. And there's gonna be more rebels in the Kazakh separatist department. Jesus Christ! I cannot wait until I form the Great One to get rid of this goddamn horde. Ah! We're gonna have to wait at least a few years to try and deal with all this. This is troubling, troubling indeed. All right. Lose the prestige. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. Who are the Liang? Oh, these guys. Okay, that's fine. One, two, three, four. Are there any more rebels anywhere? No, that is it. Once I deal with this, that's going to be it for the rebels. How long until they enforce their demands? In 30... Oh god, a couple months. Okay. That's okay. We got these we got it under control. There we do. We got it under control. Let's go take care of them. All right. Next up is just to try and take it from the woo. They will call in a variety of allies. They will call in the Shu as well. But to be honest, not really a big deal. Then it's going to be about forcing protectorates over the entire country. Ming has embraced colonialism. That's another rebellion in our vassal state, which we don't care about. Okay, this means we can mothball all our forts. Start to deal with the tremendous amount of debt that we have found ourselves in. Why are we still overextended? So, uh, we can introduce Vajnaya Buddhism. Oh god, I don't want to do that. Go away. Ah. Uh, oh my god, I did it. No! Dian. No, I still can't do it. I need Zian Yang. Oh my god. Are you serious? They will call in the Ling. Ah! I still need a province! Jesus! I can't believe I still need a province! Ridiculous, come on. I'm still gonna have to fight another war, and then I'm gonna have to fight the war against Wu to take to become the Emperor. Oh god, that's a rebellion. You son of a bitch. be fine. Yes, we have manpower issues, but they are nothing we haven't dealt with before. Wait for these guys to finish as well. There we go. That's our overextension taken care of. Why is there still so much rebellion? The war exhaustion though. And our really terrible national unity. I really wish I'd gotten a different idea group now that I think about it. It's fine. It's fine! All right, group them all together. We are moving on up now. All right. Look at that, we're building up manpower. We're building, we're getting rid of coalitions. We're amazing, it's fine. Don't worry about it, guys. Don't worry about it. I really would have liked to be able to get aggressive expansion reduction, but that's not happening anytime soon. Oh, good! There's still rebels of Kazaki up there. Oh, good. Okay, fine. The thousands of manpower I've just tried to raise will now need to be re-raised as I deal with the untold numbers of rebellions that are mounting here. This is dry land, so that's fine. We can take care of that. Turpan? Where's Turpan? Oh, there. Alright, fine. I'll accept it. I'm gonna have to go over there to take care of them. 
My vassal's all pissed off and stuff. Bartering increases. People don't like money, apparently. I will lose to inflation, sure. Apparently to improve relations with you again. If annex cost reduction, oh baby. Ah, oh, I really want that manpower bonus. I'm gonna get this in 16, in six years time. Oh my god, that's a long time. All right, let's go kill them. All these freaking rebellions. Here we go, though. This is it. This is gonna be the end of rebellions in my nation, except for these separatists that exist in. Come on. Gain with the rebels, please. You know what? No, no rebellion for you. I don't want you to rebel. Higgsy separatists? Why are there Higgsy separatists? 31,000? And Pigeon? What's you, what's you, why, why are you doing this? What is going on? Okay. Not good. Just increase autonomy. I know that kills my absolutism, but my absolutism is already dead. So I have to do this anyway. It's fine. Okay. Going. Oh, this is fine. We can kill them with just 28k. Um, and I think maybe we should start to split up and do rebels. Because there's a lot of them. For profiteering and on goal. Oh. Oh, I don't care. Hell yeah. Give me that cash. Fine, there we go. So, 15,000 men need to be replenished before anyone could be happy again. Head back to Beijing. While we wait for the good word. Gonna have to fight these guys to take that. Then we're also going to take the Emperor ship, too. That'll be fun. Eastern Korea wants to be stated. Take them. And that's going to make them pissed off. Whatever. Should be able to do this within only a couple years. That'd be good. We're going to have to wait at least a couple years to get back manpower, because it takes get about you know 6,900 a year. I need some... I need some dudes. Oh, shit. Those are Ming separatists. If the Ming... Oh, no. I'm gonna lose my border to the Wu. I'm gonna have to take them now. I've gotta fight them now for the mandate. Wait, warden over Chinese hegemony. What's the war over Chinese hegemony? Alright, let's... I'm gonna have to do this now. I'm gonna have to become emperor this second, basically. Oh, Jesus. What is happening? Alright, it's fine. Okay, I'll just... I, I, I'll wait until the rebels are an actual problem. But so far, they are... He is still the emperor. Wu is still emperor. It's just Ning is crazy powerful now. How many troops does Ning actually have? It's a stupidly large amount. Very, very small. Okay, never mind. They are two military techs ahead of me, however. Less than good. 80% for the chin, so it's 11 years. 70% for these guys, so it's, it's going down. We're getting a chance to kind of rebuild ourselves. Which is really good. And also get Korea. They are also a tributary of Japan, though, so we need to watch out for that. I really would just like to annex all the Korean land. Get everybody into Beijing. Look at that, we're reducing autonomy. Perfect. Okay. We're gonna wait a few years because we're having some troubles. Couple troubles. And when can contribute warriors be done? In three years' time. Tension between nomads and sedentary population lose loyalty and influence or support the chiefs. Oh my god. I will deal with them being pissed off because I don't really care about them very much. Oh god, they're very upset. 
Mm, okay, maybe I regret. Oh, the yearly horde unity is really bad. Okay, let's let's give them some territory then. This is bad, 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 bad. bad. Okay. There. Happy? No. Of course you're not happy. You're never happy. Why would you be happy? Nope, still not happy. But now. All right, that's something. It only goes up by point one though. My horde unity is going crazy low though. Ah, oh, ah, shit. I didn't raise- oh, I didn't raise it. Ah, oh, I should have raised it. Damn it. Why didn't I raise that? Come on, Aldrahill. Get it together. Okay. Lightning. They're gonna call in Chi and Lang- Liang and Chi. Chi is not really an issue. Neither really is Liang. All right. I think we should do this now, because mm, there's still rebels, still rebels brewing. I really need to get rid of this. Getting mad. I think we're gonna figure this out in the next episode. Because owie, owie, ow. Make sure you leave a like and a comment on the video, guys. Let me know what you think of the series so far. And I was Aldrin, and I'll continue to be. And this has been some E-Form Bye bye.